Hey there guys, what is up? Today we are going to be checking out if Grim Embrace is actually good on Plague or should you just run Corrupt Intervention. Without further ado, let's hop right in. Alrighty, we got Torment Creek here on the Cold Wind Farm map. Um, <clears throat> this is going to be a little bit insane, but let's try it anyway. Um, okay, so immediately I hear a scream. I think someone got unlucky with their uh, banjo perk. Someone's over this way. Yep. 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 Okay, she's actually pretty dang decent. Oh, I forgot about the new tiles. The new tiles are brutal. down <clears throat> perfect that's all i wanted was that down um i can probably hold her right here grab that pool you get to go Pain risk. boom that was not the most progressed gen apparently let me go ahead and grab that Ah, oh, this might have been. Which would actually make a little bit of sense. Where'd she go? Huh. What? Excuse me. Um... Alright, nice. I'm just gonna hook her right here immediately. Kick this, throw up on it again. Okay, that's fine. Someone's running a full build for it, which is a okay, I guess. Um, I have to let. Oh, I can't see where gens are. That's really bad for me. Bring it. Boom, boom. Okay. He's injured, he's injured, he's injured. You're not gonna bolt that? Okay. I guess. I should probably break it though. I mean, I'm using Brutal. There's not really a point of me not breaking it. They're giving me more pools of devotion, which is good. It also means I'll be able to soon just, like, pick one up. Grim Embrace, at least. Which will be very, very helpful. Especially in defending that gen. We have two pools of devotion. That's great. Hopping back over here. Just 
grabbing that. Can I come around here? Hey there. Run off. Smart. Got you. Got you. You're dead. Let me see what I can do here. Down. That's huge. I mean, two downs with that one. She got picked up, but that's really okay because I have right here a pain res. Which shows me that that is the most progressed gen. I mean, that's just really big. Let me snuff the boon. Which honestly, the boon could have picked her up. Let me head back. I need to throw up on her. There we go. Now, if I grab this, I can actually force them to make a pretty risky play here. They should be unhooking right about now. Boom. I have no idea where she went. Oh, this is bad. I'm wasting this ability. Not my greatest moments. Oh, hi. I need to down you. Got her. That's good. I can break that, be pretty well off. She goes down right here. You did not play that well enough. Hit her with that. We're in a pretty okay spot. We know that he went for the save, which actually really does tell us all we need to know here, because that means I can actually go grab a corrupt pool almost immediately, get it down very quickly here. Especially if they don't start cleansing and stuff. This is going to result in some very quick downs. Um, now we have tier 4 on this. So we can actually spend a little time looking. Not this one. Immediately. Go over here. That way. Back there. I see you. You're dead. Nice. She's death hook as well. Okay. I mean, her being death hook's really big for us. Um, it means I can actually spend a lot less time near here. Um, and less time worrying about if she's on something. It's huge. I'm going to kick this really quick. Immediately make my way back to the other gen. Since that's already grown up on, that's huge. If they're going to stay injured, I mean, I can also deal with that. I've got every, all the necessary stuff. That's not the greatest, because if they get this gen done now... 
which it was very, very close. She's over there. Someone got sick. I'm assuming that Jen. I am going to continue to kick this and push them off of it as much as I can. Yep, I need to head back. I might actually be able to catch her here and then head back quick enough. I might be able to do it. And I believe she's death hook as well. Which if she is, that's pretty big. I don't think I make it. If I would have made this pain res. Oh, that was big pain res. That was huge for us. This is like really bad for her. huge <clears throat> I knew that they weren't gonna give up that easy immediately head over to the hook. I I know how their brain works enough enough to hopefully counter this game plan okay she cleansed that's fine if he has a pain res still oh my goodness Yep, good game. It's over. It's over. And immediately it's over. Even if she does unhook, even if... All these things could happen and I'd still win. Because that gen just now is halfway. And getting 50% of a gen alone is insanely difficult. Plus with me heading back right now, they roughly have two seconds to get out of there. I see him, but I'm going to go for her. If I can make a little bit of a long shot here. I don't even have to. Beautiful. Um, yeah. Any offerings? No. Huh? I downed you here. What? What? Guys, I literally downed her. Is she a subtle cheater? I'm so confused. I did down her right there. You sure you want to do that, bud? Let's see. Nice. Bad flashbang. Oh, what was that? Nice. Nice attempt. I see him over there. I'm going to go this way then.
Wow. Oh, okay. That was a really, really close 4k. But we did get in the end, so that's good. GG's. I don't know where that hatch was. Must have been this way. Alright, Father's Campbell's Chapel. Now, I do really start to see, I think you guys even started to see, last game, a lot of the strength that does actually come with something like Grim Embrace, it slows the game down later on rather than at the start. Yes, 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 but if you can get your corruption going and all of that, well, then you really don't need the slowdown early on because you can just snowball effect everything. Okay, so we haven't found anyone quite yet. Which is not looking great for us by any means. I still have not seen a single person. Nice. That's exactly what you want super early on is a very quick down with Plague. Uh, trying to get that infection as crazy as you humanly possibly can. And a Scorch Hook if you can, but... I heard you. pop out and get this nice little tap here. It's a pretty good hit to have. She cleansed. These are some big mistakes they are making very early here. Um, huge time mishaps, huge everything. So, we should be fine here. I'm gonna go ahead and hook Scorch Hook. That should slow our game down immensely. Now we will go ahead and adjust this and then just start walking over here. Okay, that's not too, too bad. I mean, getting some nice quick hits in and a quick down like that's pretty dang good. We are actually, two people now have the illness. So we're gonna go ahead and just hook up here. Come over here really quick, just check these out. But I think that one did get hit. That's what I would assume anyway happened. Did it? Okay, they got Dwight off the hook, which is A-OK -okay by me. They're running this way. Hi there, Claudette. You're okay, don't you worry. Maybe I'll just let Claudette go really quick, grab up a Corrupt Purge again. She's in trouble. That was absolutely massive, okay. And we actually make that Scourge over there. I don't know if she's already been Scourge hooked, but 
Oh, they are in for just a really rough time right now. Sheesh. Yeah, if you get going with Plague, it can be really brutal. Someone's over here. They went back here. Down. Like I said, you get really going with Plague. You barely need to break pallets. They got their first gen now. That's not going to do anything. I'm sorry to tell them. But I did hook Dwight on a Scourge before, so I know he doesn't have anything left. That's fine. Most people are death hooked by now. I'm going to go ahead, actually, and break this. Because I have Brutal Strength. Um, which really isn't necessary with the Grim Embrace and with everything. The way it is. I do know she's over here. She ran somewhere in this direction. I don't know where. Someone has to go for that unhook right now. Okay, they're in a little bit of trouble because they didn't go for that unhook. They're going to get a gen done here probably, which is A-OK -okay by me. You go down. Jolt right here would be very, very deadly. And they didn't, they're not going to get that gen done. I'm not in any danger whatsoever. I believe this person hasn't even been hooked, so... They're all worried right now about trying to get cleansed and healed and stuff. But really, that's not what they should be doing at all. I was going to say, they need to go for that Dwight right now. Now, I have a feeling he's... Yeah. I was going to say. I'll go for the Dwight. Not a problem at all. He is death hook. So I do want to get someone out of here as soon as possible. The other guy, I believe the Renato has not been hooked yet. Which is fine. I'm going to go ahead and pick up over here that Corrupt Purge. You're dead. That's good. One person dead at three gens left is very, very good. Just this Corruption. We're going to walk back over this way because they're probably running this way. If not, they're on this gen. So I'm going to probably just kind of listen. See what I can do. Someone's over here. I'm going to leave them. Because I know that Renato's right here. I know I can down Renato pretty effortlessly. Oh. Oh, uh, okay. I mean, I guess. I get. I guess. My man, you just gave me another Scourge hook, though. Like, was that really worth it? If they can pop that gen right now, or that gen... It was great for them, or both, but I don't think either of them are, like, close enough to doing it. So that's not great. I know it's going to block these gens now. It got that middle gen. Oh, they're working on three gens right now. They're not in, like, a horrible spot by any means. She ran that way. Okay. I'm vaulting this. I see scratch marks. I know they're this way. How come he didn't drop that? That seems like a really bad play. I hit that. Down. I was going to say, what are you doing, bud? Seemed like a bad play, and then it was a bad play. So Grim Embrace just, like, really helped us progress that gen up. Um, two people dead. They really can't do much here. I'm going to come up here, kick this, throw up on it as well. That way it's contagious, at least, for, you know, 25 seconds-ish. And they're going to have a really fun time trying to get that done. If I... Did he immediately jump on that gen? I think he did, I reckon. Hi there, bud. Oh, that's really no problem. Yep. And Plague is, in my opinion, definitely an A-tier killer. Um, I think Plague... You could make an argument for Plague being 
one of the stronger killers for sure. And especially if you know what you're doing with Plague, she is easily one of the most deadly in the game. Um, you spread the pressure enough, you get people sick, it's, it's a brutal combo. And like you guys are starting to see it right now, how brutal this can actually be. And then Grim Embrace on top of it, Grim Embrace is a really good perk that you never really see utilized. I mean, Corrupt is also very good, but I feel Grim Embrace is better. Only because Corrupt only lasts until you get a first down. You get that first down really quickly with a killer, and you kind of wasted a perk slot. But not Grim Embrace. Grim Embrace... What? By the way, guys, I swear I hit her way earlier. Renato's now down. They're both down. That's GG's. Honest to God. He's given up. Alright, that's fine. If he thinks Michael's OP, wait until he finds out about my plague. <laughs> oh, man. Dead. We'll walk back, grab up the spot at. Good game, guys. Good game. Ooh, and hatch spawned right here. Beautiful. 